Hello guys and welcome back to another episode of Virtue's Last Reward. We're starting off with the escape, you know, untouched from last episode. Finally getting back into the escape, it's been a little bit. And we're in the treatment center with Clover and Quirk. Um, yeah. So this time it'll be like a two-person escape since Quirk's knocked out. Unless he waits up during this, but we'll have to see. So yeah, let's let's look around. We got the beds. This is this room's locked, I believe. There are three treatment pods in the pod room. There are numbers on the end of each one. Reading from left, there are one, two, and three. Well, this one has a. Oh wait, no, that's just three. Is that yeah, it's a dash, but it's not really. I didn't see three treatment pods. What about the computer? I guess. No. Okay. That's fine. Oh god, right. Yeah. So, I guess let's just go left. Plant? Oh my god. I was just memeing, but it, there's arrows on it. Seems a little sus. A plant. Look at these lush green leaves. This sturdy, thick shaft. It looks like it's full of energy and stamina. How does a plant have stamina? Did you notice there's something stuck in the trunk? It looks like a piece of green plastic. Let me see if I can get it out. Huh? Looks like it's really in there. I think it's stuck on something. I guess we'll just have to take the whole thing then. Huh? Well, that plastic thing could be important. Oh, yeah, I guess you're right. Healthy plant. Thick and full of stamina. A healthy plant. There's a bit of green plastic sitting out of the trunk. If it's in there real good, though, I can't pull it out. Okay, maybe that... that okay, well, we have a whole ass plant in our back pocket. Uh, lion. I kind of miss the nine 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 arrow keys. This feels, and I I just haven't gotten used to the controls. Feels harder for like I don't know for me anyways. There's a button under the screen. Push it then right and there. Hey, it turned on. Looks like there's something on it. Ah, uh, what the heck is this? It says start in the corner there. Maybe it's a board game? Hmm. You have found an image of a board game. You can review it in the archive. Okay. There's a board game image here. Is this a hint? Guess we'll have to see later. Okay, I, I play board games. Can I click the light? No, you can't stay up there. Okay, we got door we came through. I know you're worried about Quark, so don't you think we should get him to the pot as soon as we can? That should be our first priority. Come on, Clover. Who are you kidding? You don't care about Quark. <laughs> Probably. Maybe she cares a little as a human. Jellyfish. Lion. Little hole to put it, in. put it, put something in. Nice lion. That's a pretty realistic painting. It's a really, really, really real lion. Don't sing in a whisper like that. All right, let, repeat. It's a real. Wait, I need it. It's a really, really, really real lion. It's not really a song. Never mind. But close enough. It's creepy. It looks kind of like he's toughing up a hairball. I think he's trying to eat something, not cough it up. He's trying to eat a hairball? Uh, probably something else. What? I... I don't know. There's just a hole there. So we need to put something into the hole? Yeah, I think so. Potted plant? Pitch of a lion. Guess potted plant is not the answer. So we need a circular thing? We got the jellyfish. Hello. Oh my gosh. Aliens. Pretty sure they're just jellyfish. 
Aliens. There are three jellyfish. Two yellow ones and a purple one. What's that inside the purple one? Is it digesting human flesh? Why would you even think something like that? I don't think it's meat anyway. Look at it. It's too solid. I think it's a tile of some sort. Hmm, I wonder if we can get it out. Hopefully we don't need to kill the jellyfish. Also, we need a key. There's a lid on the tanks. You can't open it? Nope, looks like it's locked. Well, it's got a keyhole. Then I guess we need to unlock it if we want to open it. I mean, it looks like the circle for the lion picture. Oops. Okay. Well. Another potted plant. Not healthy? Inferior? Look, there's a plant over here, too. This one's all withered. It has a piece of plastic stuck in it, too. Hmm, guess this doesn't come out, either. Guess I might as well take this one, too, pot and all. Nice. A withered plant. There's a bit of red plastic sticking out of the trunk. It's in the real glue, though. I can't pull it out. Combine the plants! Damn it. Okay, well, new plant just dropped. This is the exit. It's locked. This is locked on it. It must be what's keeping the door shut. It looks like the one, just like the one in the infirmary. Yeah, if we saw one in the true quarters, too. So in order to get out of here, we're gonna have to find the key that fits. It. Yeah, that's how it worked before. Coolio. Oh, there's a clock with the things. Safe. Oh my god. Yeah, we need to look down. It's really awkward because we look back up. Anything else we missed? Looks like it's just lights. So all we have is the clock left, right? Oh wait, no, we have the door, but that's locked, I believe. Oh, is it not? Nope, it's locked. Shoot, won't open. There's a control panel in the middle of it. Yeah, I think this is how you unlock it. The door can only be unlocked with the correct four-digit code. You can use the hit and blow numbers to determine the correct answer. For each of the numbers that is the correct number, in the correct place you will get one hit. For each of the numbers that is the correct number but not the correct place, you would get one blow. You have 10 guesses to figure out the password. If you guess wrong 10 times, okay. It's kind of like Mastermind, I think, though I haven't played Mastermind in so long. I'm not sh quite sure how it's supposed to work, but I guess I can mess with it a bit. Hit blow. Okay, so this is like a guessing game, right? So hit means it's right, blow means it's the right number, just in the wrong spot. Uh, let's just... One, two, three, four. One hit, one blow. I guess that's kind of awkward. So, let's do... One... I don't know, three, four, two. Okay, one, I think one hit. So we'll keep one. Four, two, three. Two blow. So it wasn't one. Shit. So one's not actually in it. But f two, three. Okay. Hmm. One of these hits. Interesting. Am I crazy? Why is like, I thought, 
How do I play this again? No. Like, why? I don't know. <laughs> so it was, so it's two, right? Two here. I don't know, dude. So it's three, two here. How? Wait, I'm so confused. What was it? Nine, two, four, six. Nine, two, four, six. Okay, wait, I need, I need the instructions. Uh, this is hard. You can do it. You can use the hidden blow. The correct number in the correct place will, 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 you will get one hit. For each of the numbers that is the threat number, but not in the threat place, you would get one blow. You have 10 guesses, if you guess around 10 times. Okay, let's... Two blows. So let's shift everything by one, maybe? Like four, one, two, three. Still two blows. Three, four, one, two. Three, four, one, two. As okay, I think three and four are in this spot, but like. Three eight nine four. I'm a little confused. So it only shows like is this switching around or like what's happening here? I don't three five eight one three five eight one Am I crazy? <laughs> I feel like I'm going insane. Why is it only sh I don't know, man. I do not know. Two blows. Okay. Let's do one, two. Five sets. One hit, two hit, one blow. Interesting. One hit, wait, two hit, one blow. Two hit, one blow? How? Let me try that again. <laughs> I know it's kind of weird. One, two, five, six. Three, four, one, two. 
Okay, one, two, six, five. Like, how does this work? Okay, whatever. One, two, five, seven. Two, one, five, eight. I just like is this changing on top or like what's happening? Two, three, five, six. Two, three, five, six? Did we not do that? I, this puzzle is breaking me. I'm just so confused about what's happening. I, one hit, two blow. So three numbers should be the same. So I'm just gonna do one, two, three, five. Which means f four was one of them. Right. So one, two, four, six. Okay. Four, two, or four, one, two, seven. Four, seven. I just don't understand the rules. Like, I, like I understand the rules. I think there just needs to be more rules. <laughs> For each of the numbers that is the correct number in the correct place, you would get one hit. For each of the numbers that is the correct number but not in the correct place, you would get one blow. Yeah, so correct one is a hit. In correct place is a blow. I don't know. Let's just keep going. <laughs> one hit, one blow. So we'll, we'll keep one, two. One, two, four, five. Interesting. How about one, six, two, seven? Right, so it's actually... The two is right, so it'd be like... Right? How? So one is right. I, I like, what is the answer to this? So uh, three blows, three blows. Where the fuck do they go? Three, six, one, two. I'm just trying to shift them all over. Plus throw in... I don't know, a nine. So it would be... Two, three, nine, one. Two, three, nine, one. Two, three, nine, one. Or I 
I don't fuck it. Six one three five. How does that six one three five? Wasn't two like a guaranteed blow? Six one three five. I don't under I don't fucking understand, dude. I'm going odds. One blow. One of these are right. All right, I'm keeping one and going evens. Hmm. Okay, two hits is really good. Three, four, six, seven. Three, four, six, seven. Memo, uh, so sh it's not shit, but like, I feel like I need a notepad. Wait, this is this is doable, guys. This is doable. Let me make a cheeky notepad right now. So, th three, f uh, three, four, eight, nine is one hit, two blows, and the last one was three, four, six, seven, which was two hit, three hit. Wait, no, it was two hits, one blow, right? Which just two hits. Oh, yeah, yeah, it was just two hits for three, four, six, seven, two hits, two hots, whatever. <laughs> this is interesting because I th think it might be something like. Oh god. Okay, wait. Watch this. No. Okay, maybe. Oh, where's my notepad? It was 8, 9. So 9, 8. So the six is wrong. How is the four wrong? Okay, wait, three. So the four was wrong. Shit, I should have been writing this. Now it's kind of doomed. Okay. Th three, nine, eight, five. Okay, it is three, nine. Eight is in the last one. But I don't know what the last number is. Oh, no. Executive decision doing two. No, three nine six eight. It was close. Wait, I kind of understand what I'm doing, but like not really. Okay, this is the real run. I know we spent so much time on this, but I want to solve this really bad. So we'll actually record good hits. So let, let's let's go. Evens here, even Stevens. Three blows. Three blows is very impressive. <laughs> Two, four, six, eight. Three blows. Okay, so we can do a lot with this. Let's subtract 
the eight. It's like if you subtract the eight and you put in like nine, it might just be like three blows again, but the nine might be right also. Oh, I hate it. <laughs> so three of these numbers are correct at least. All right, let's. All right. Let's do like one, three, five, eight. Okay. One, three, five, eight is one blow, which might just be the eight. All okay. So like, can we do a nine? So like, is a is a combination made out of? Ooh. Okay, a good way to check this is to do one three five and then throw in like a six. Okay, one three five six is one blow, which might just be the this is it so let's do one one three five four okay one three five four is one blow i know this might be a waste but just to like super confirm unless we like fucked it up one three five two okay so two is out so three so three numbers for sure is four, six, eight, nine. Oh my God. <laughs> feels so simple, but like it just, it's taking us forever. Okay. So let's do, we have five chances for this. How many combinations are there? So there's, f oh God, four, six, eight, nine feel like there's a lot of combinations. I don't think we can hit it all. Four, six, eight. But we can cross them out when we get there. So there's four, six, eight, nine, which might work, to be honest. Okay, let's just try that. Four, six, eight, nine. Four, six, eight, nine. Three blows. Wait. Is nine not the answer? So we've checked. Oh wait, we're missing seven. Ooh, that could have been a disaster. So it's four, six, eight, seven. Yeah, okay. Well, that that's actually kind of bad. But now we know that it's not four, six, eight for sure. I mean, it, it is like the numbers, but it's not that way. So we can do seven, four, six, eight. Okay, so it's not se so. Okay, so this is. <laughs> Oh, I don't know if we'll make it. So four is not in the first or second. It could be third, it could be fourth. So we just move it, right? To put eight first. Oh my God, I'm scared. I don't know if this is gonna work. Eight. At least I understand what I'm doing, but oh, we don't have the time. So it's either, ah, I'm gonna try to keep four there and move. It could be four, it could be seven. Let's switch. Okay. Well, seven can't be last. And seven can't be first. So seven is either second or third. And fourth to... Oh. Okay. 
So if I put fourth, fourth, sits, first, and eighth. Wait, eighth, eight cannot be third. Wait, let me write this down. So eight, seven, four, sits is one hit. So let's, let's logic this out. Four cannot be one and two, so it has to be three or four for sure. Seven cannot be last or first. It can be second or third. Six cannot be first or second. Oh my god, my brain. So if you want to move 8, it cannot go here, and it cannot go here. It's either first, 8 is either first or second. Or crunch time. 8 is either 1 or 2. 7 is either, 7 is either 3 or 4. Oh wait, no, seven's either two or three. Two or three. Four is either three or four. And six is either, um, one or four. So if you want to do eight, one, then six has to be four, which means oh. <laughs> okay, okay. So in a, in a world where eight is one, it would have to be Eight, seven, three. All right, eight, eight, seven, four, six. I'm just, I'm gonna wait. We did that though, so it's wrong. Right, so this is wrong with only one hit. If you want, we could try sit in front which means eight would need to be number two, which means seven would need to be number three and four would need to be four. I'm gonna try this and then bet all in the last one. So six, eight, seven, four. Two hits, two blows. Oh my God. Okay, two hits, two hits. Now this is interesting. This is where it gets interesting. Because none of them are the same as 8746, which has one guaranteed hit. So it's a different hit than what we just got. <laughs> which means we should be able to logic this out. Right. So what part... Oh my god. So two needs to stay the same in this combination for this to work. And we need to joint something from eight, seven, four, six. How are we gonna do that? So if eight is right, It's, it messes up the whole thing, so it's probably not right. If seven is right, if, oh my God, <laughs> this notepad is so long. So if you do, so seven can only be two and three. 
So if you switch, if you put seven to two, then eight would need to be, so it can't work, right? It cannot work. I don't know what's easy. What about four? Four can be three or four. And seven can be two or three. But we need... <laughs> oh, shit. I don't want to fuck this up. We did so good. So eight has to be one or two. So if we want to take... If we want to put eight one... 8, 1 would mess up 6, 1. So 6 would have to be 4. And if 6 is 4... Wait. We have 7, 4 left. But it doesn't work, right? Because two needs to be in the same spot. <sighs> but how do you do this? I don't know, man. I'm going to lose my mind on one puzzle. <laughs> this is feeling like a nice 40-minute puzzle, huh? <laughs> um... It's just that we know some answers can't be right. Like, eight has to be one or two, right? Right. And six has to be one or four. Seven has to be two or three. There has to be a way to calculate this. I'm just drawing a blank because it's late and I'm stupid. Um, if you want to keep 7 or sit that front, 8 needs to be 2, then 7 needs to be 3, and 4 needs to be 4. What does that change from our... It's literally the same thing. Okay, so we won't do that. <laughs> if you want 8 to be 2... Wait, we did that. Okay, if we want 8 to be 1, then 7 needs to be 2, 4 needs to be 3, and 6 needs to be 4. Okay, that's the first one. <laughs> okay, we're just looping. Okay, okay. Um... Yeah, those are like the two combinations. Am I crazy? Like, what else can you do? It doesn't really work any other way, I think. Yeah, is there like, so if eight, yeah, what the fuck? What else is there? Do we just fucking do it? But I don't know what to fucking do. Okay, wait, 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 wait. What haven't I done with this combination? So we've done seven, four, six, eight, which dot is zero. We did four, six, eight, seven, which dot is zero. So yeah, four needs to be three or four, for sure. Six needs to be one or four. Like, I, I'm i crazy, I don't 
know how math works. So I'm just gonna... I don't know. Are we really gonna like just... It's been 40 minutes, oh my god. Okay, let's just start again. Let's just take a guess. I'm gonna keep seven four and change eight and six this makes no sense but i i give up four blows it was six eight four seven it was six eight four seven oh my god so yeah we just needed to change that but how could seven be last because we got four blows on four six eight seven i swear to god this hidden blow thing is like it's messed up, dude. It's messed up, I swear. We that shouldn't have done that. Okay, restarting. We are gonna finish this puzzle tonight, I swear. D am I crazy? We we did we did the combination with seven last and we got four blows. I don't know, this is I'm gonna say rid. But maybe I'm just lying to myself. One blow on two four six eight. That's a little crazy. Two four six eight is one blow crazy okay let's do one three five seven three blows okay now we just need to find this one three five seven is so nine is just not here right nine is not here three blows so yeah we can trim nine just kind of type nine gone nine gone now we need to find out which is which so let's go two one three five two one three five interesting two one three five is three blows Okay, let's do four one three five. Four one three five is two three. Four one three five is two blows. Which makes me think that it's Two one three seven. So it it is two, and it's either one one three. It's two seven something something, right? Or we'll just do seven two three five. Okay, yeah. So seven two three five is what we got. All right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> Seven, two, three, five, four blows. We can do this. Four blows. That is our number combination. So we know in the future, which may or may not be true. Those are the exceptions. So let's just shift to five, seven, two, three, five, seven, two, three. Four blows on five, seven, two, three. That helps a lot. Kinda. Five, seven, two, three, four blows. Okay, watch this. Five, seven, three, two. One hit. Five, seven, three, two, one hit. Oh, maybe this is being too conservative. Five, seven, three, two is one hit. Which means either two or three's locked in. Nope, nope. It means it means two is in the right place because seven, two, three, four, five was four blows. So two is locked for sure. So we'll put a two up top. Permalot. Okay. Wait, isn't it just three, five, seven, two? Maybe? 
Oh my god, we did it. It only took like the whole video. Don't worry, we'll play more, but Jesus Christ. I swear the last one was bugged. Unless I just miswrote it. Whatever. <laughs> it all works out in the end. You did it, Sigma. Looks like that was the answer. Phew, that was lucky. Not luck, all skill. Sure, it took a long time to do, but like literally all skill. Anyway, it seems to have a lot. One puzzle down. Okay, we're in the freaking chamber. This one has a clock on it. And some stuff. Let's check computer. There's a message on the screen. Maintenance complete. Please insert activation chip. What does it mean about an activation chip? Well, I guess it's a chip we insert to activate the pod. You think, why are you being like that? This is important. We, okay, okay, I get it. We need to get port into one of these, right? Yeah. Yeah, looks like it. Okay, well. Let's look at this. Looks like there are three pods. From the left, there's pod one, two, and three. There are numbers written on them. You really can't just see them from here. Yeah, one, two, three. Also, they got um handles. Maybe they're for opening the pods up? There's nothing here. Yeah, it's empty. No clues or... Wait, there's something written on the inside of the cover. Part three, there's nothing particular. The cover on the other hand. Huh? Oh, one, one, one. It's such like a digital clock. 11 hours and one minute? Okay, let's open the other stuff. Oh, well, okay, wait. Here, let me let me put that on a memo real fast. Pod, see, I'll use a memo, just notepad was easier for that one. Pod three equals... Oh, well, there's a key and a clock. Yeah, it's a key, isn't it? Silver key. This just looks like a normal key. Have you seen any keyholes that look like it might fit? We have indeed. Uh, go back. A clock, huh? Did you think it was a nipple with two hairs growing out of it? N no, I thought it was a clock. Of course not. The hands are pointing to 620. Hmm. Interesting. <sighs> you liked my writing? Pot. It's hard with a mouse, man. 620. Alright, get out of here. And final clock. Well, we have this. Already written. This is a clock. The hands are pointed to 715. You sure you're reading it right? Yeah, see the 12? That's the top. So 750. Oops. Memo. Pod. 1. 7. 15. Outside. Just in case it matters. Because there might be something written inside also. Oh, there is another key. There's something there. A key? White key. This weird, weird looking key actually. I think this is called a dimple key. It's, a pr it's pretty thick too. That's cool. So it uses the yeah. act. The dimples to unlock. The cover for pod one seems pretty normal. Okay, so it doesn't matter. All right, I think we've got all we can get for now in here. So we didn't really look here. 
Ooh, you have some stuff I want to look at. Oh, here we go. A binder. Looks like there's a piece of paper in it. It says how to open the pod room door. Oh, well. Okay, dude. <laughs> Oh, it's literally the instructions you got from just going to the game. Okay, whatever. Tablet. A tablet. There's a message on it. Four pieces for the first password. One piece for the second password. What the hell is that supposed to mean? If I touch it, the screen changes. Enter a four-digit password, then press enter key on the right. Um, no. Actually, maybe. What is this dice game? I don't know. Is this a plot? <laughs> it doesn't make sense. Okay, let, we'll come back. Um, Do you think maybe pieces can mean like the pieces in the board game? Pieces? Don't you remember what it said on the tablet before the password screen popped up? Like four pieces for the first password... One piece for the second password. Those pieces. Uh, okay, but what board game are you talking about? You already forgot? Okay, wait. Maybe I had the right idea. Four pieces for the password. I just... Clock? Give me, give me clock, maybe? I don't know, dude. A wall clock, nothing strange here. Yeah, that's definitely not strange. What? Are you serious? Are we even looking at the same clock? Everything about it is abnormal. Really? Totally looks like a regular clock to me. Oh my gosh. Okay, abnormality, abnormality number one. No hands. Oh yeah, I guess it doesn't have any. What do you mean you guess? How could you miss that? S sorry. Anyway, abnormality number two. There's something weird. There's some weird green glowy thing. Oh yeah, there is. What is that? I guess there's no way to knowing without taking it out. But there's a cover, right? You can't get to it. Yeah, and it won't open. Shoot. Well, duh. There's no way it's going to be that easy. So if you want to get this green thing, we have to figure out a way to get that cover open. Yep. Abnormality number three is the hole on the bottom left corner. Huh? I wonder what it is. I think it's a, probably a keyhole. Oh ho, then that means... Wait, we can think later. I've got two more points of abnormality. Number four. Turn your attention to the other side of the clock. Specifically the bottom right corner. What do you think these are? Well, they're two slots painted red and green. Do you think they're for memory cards? They sure look like they are. And I've saved the best for last. Abnormality number five is about number four. In the middle. Huh? Look, see, it says number four on the clock face. That no no four is fifth abnor is the fifth abnormality. Yes, ah oh, yes, I see it. It is rather odd. Does that mean this is the fourth clock? Anyway, those are the five weird things about this clock. Where are you looking anyway? Uh, at the clock? Then your eyes must be worse than I thought. Okay, let, lot to unpack. A tablet. The screen says the following. Oh, wait, I didn't want to do this. Okay, let me out. This is pointless. I don't know what the password I'm supposed to put here. Clover said it might have to do with a board game. Alright, well, we have two keys, so... First off, just because I want to see. All right, silver key, no go. Huh? That's strange. What is it? The key doesn't fit. Hmm, you think maybe this key goes somewhere else then? Like where? Well, I know, there's a... There's another thing, but we'll try the dimple key. Easy, haha. -ha. It's open. Alright, let's... We'll, we'll come back. I want to open the other... I want to open the jellyfish. Because it's funny. 
and cute. The clock is like a whole another problem to tackle. There we go. Now I should be able to open this thing. What the hell? There's a sudden lid. Yeah, but it's got a hole in the middle. If you stick your hand in there, maybe you can grab that one with the meat in it. It's not meat. Whatever. Let's give it a shot. Ouch. Ah, hot. Shit, this water's really hot. Really? Really. Then these bubbles. Yeah, it's boiling. Super jellyfish. No way! No jellyfish could survive in boiling water. They are aliens. Yeah, we should try and get the purple one to rise up to the top somehow. If we can get right under the hole... Right, get it right under the hole in the lid, I think I can grab it. You can move the three jellyfish by clicking and dragging the mouse or using the arrow keys. Move the purple jellyfish to the hole using the water currents in the tank. If you move one of the yellow jellyfish to the hole instead, you are a failure and we are very disappointed in you. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's do this. Yo, it's Bioshock. Kinda. So we... Oh, it's like the first game. Okay. Oh, uh, well, retry. Huh? This is pretty hard. Something like this? Oh, I did it. <laughs> okay, not, not bad. Aiden, you still got it? Give me that jellyfish. Gotta grab it jelly fast. What the heck? Jellyfish and fast, cause the water is hot. It was cute. This is Ellen. She's a mysterious, intelligent life form from the outer reaches of space. Don't give it a name. Here, here, take it. H hey, stop it. What if it grabs onto my face and lays eggs in me or something? Haha, -ha, come on, it just wants to give you a hug. Yeah, it's not a real. It just wants to hug you normally, not hug your face. Besides, it's not even alive. It's a thing, man-made, like a toy or something. But it's digesting a chunk of meat. That's not meat. Then what is it? Hold on. I'll pull it out now. Oh, I wonder where this goes. It's human flesh. <laughs> no, it's not. It's a ceramic tile. Oh, well, yeah, I guess it's only red on one side. There are two jellyfish floating lazily in the tank. Alright. Have fun, yellow jellies. Just stick you in here. Yep. Fits perfectly. Yeah. I don't think it did anything th Look! Huh? What the heck? What the heck is this? Dude, he knows what I'm about to say. A laser? Well, I'm gonna scan the plants, I guess. Because I don't have any better idea. Gosh, I didn't think there'd be something like this behind the picture. A laser. This thing is shining a laser beam across. Oh, well, I guess we should look where it's shining. It's probably a smart idea. It's shining at three, which means 11 1. Gonna do this. What does that mean? It's a hint? I don't know, let's look at the... What the heck am I supposed to do with these plants, man? The plants are just chilling. Okay. 
can I oh do we just put the plant here and just like put it against the clock maybe these are like card slots there's one red one and a green one yeah I, can, I can't never mind we need to pull it out all right what's happening here hmm well I guess I'll grab this thing first chip with number one written on it a chip with the green light on it not sure what it does I guess this what oh wait I'm stupid okay right 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 number one pod I understand kinda here Oop. oh look the color changed I think it says something too. There's a message on the screen. Before use, the system must be initialized. Please perform the following tests. One, treat vegetation. Two, freeze vegetation. Until tests are complete, pod will not function with human occupant. What the heck is this? You can't put a person until, until it runs its sets. Seems pretty clear to me. Then what about quirk? Don't worry. We just need to run the tests. Something about treating and freezing a plant? Yeah, then treating made sense. These being, these being pods after all. But freezing? Well, we don't really have a choice, do we? We gotta follow the instru instructions. Excuse me. Come on, we don't have time to just sit around. We gotta do these tests so we can, we can get fork into one of these pods. Yeah, right. Got it. I know that's exciting, but I think we're gonna have to end here. Hour mark. Two in the morning feel like maybe we're close to winning, but like, who knows? At least we can get the chips out of the plants next time. But yeah, I mean, thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. I know the majority of the time was spent on the Mastermind game. Still think we got snubbed, unless I'm dumb. If you if you notice me being dumb. I guess it's hard to tell because, because you didn't see that notepad. But you know what? I'm happy we were able to solve it, at least without any help little bit of redemption um from that calculator thing last escape but yeah hopefully you enjoyed this episode thank you for watching and see you next time where we will hopefully escape the treatments center plant center center right there <laughs> but yeah thanks for watching bye